Welcome to the F-Bomb Podcast. I'm your host, Shannon Schroeder, Executive Function Coach. I help neurodivergent women learn tips and strategies to improve the life skills that will help them be successful. Understanding Attention, a Comprehensive Guide. Attention is a fundamental cognitive skill that plays a crucial role in our daily lives. It enables us to focus, process information, and engage with the world around us. For neurodivergent women, understanding attention is particularly important as it can significantly impact various aspects of their lives from academics and work to relationships and self-care. Today we'll explore the intricacies of attention, including its different dimensions, common challenges, and effective strategies for managing and optimizing attention. The Science of Attention Attention is a complex cognitive process that involves the allocation of mental resources to specific stimuli or tasks. It allows us to filter out irrelevant information and focus on what is important. To understand attention, we need to look at its various components. One component is sustained attention, which refers to the ability to maintain focus on a particular task or stimulus over an extended period. Selective attention, on the other hand, involves directing our focus to specific stimuli while ignoring distractions. Divided attention is the capacity to allocate attention to multiple tasks simultaneously. By exploring these different types of attention, we can gain a deeper understanding of how attention functions and how it may vary among neurodivergent people. In addition to the different types of attention, it's also important to recognize that attention is not a one-size-fits-all phenomenon. Different people may exhibit variations in their attentional abilities and preferences. You might excel in in sustained attention but struggle with selective attention, while someone else might have a knack for dividing their attention effectively. By acknowledging these individual differences, we can tailor strategies and interventions to meet your specific needs. Attention and the brain. Research has shown that attention is closely tied to various regions and networks within the brain. Attention is a complex cognitive process that involves intricate neural networks and interactions within the brain. The regions and structures in the brain work together to support attentional functions. While it's not really necessary for you to know all the parts of the brain, understanding that each region controls different things can help explain why attention is such a big topic and why it can be so varied among people. One of the key areas involved in attention is the prefrontal cortex, located in the frontal lobe. The prefrontal cortex is responsible for executive functions, which include intentional control, decision-making, and goal-directed behavior. The parietal cortex is another region closely associated with attention. It helps in directing attention and processing sensory information. The parietal cortex receives input from different sensory modalities and helps prioritize and allocate attention to to relevant stimuli. Additionally, the parietal cortex contributes to spatial attention, allowing us to focus on specific locations in our environment. If your struggle is here, you might have a hard time focusing if there is physical clutter in your space. You end up paying equal attention to all the things. Another brain structure involved in attention is the thalamus. The thalamus acts as a relay station, relaying sensory information from various sensory organs to the relevant brain regions. It helps regulate the flow of information and coordinate attentional processes. By filtering and modulating sensory inputs, the thalamus helps direct attention to stimuli that are most relevant to the task at hand. Again, this is challenging for neurodivergent people because you can't necessarily filter out the different inputs to determine which are important and which ones aren't. Neurotransmitters such as dopamine and norepinephrine also play significant roles in attention. Dopamine in particular is closely linked to reward and motivation and it influences the brain's attentional systems. Imbalances in dopamine levels can affect attention and contribute to attentional disorders like ADHD. When working with clients with ADHD, I often talk about dopamine-seeking behavior. You like the dopamine hit, the chemical release in your brain that is a reward. Understanding the intricate neurological underpinnings of attention can provide valuable insights into attentional difficulties experienced by neurodivergent individuals and inform the development of targeted interventions and support strategies. Attention Challenges for Neurodivergent People Neurodivergent people often face unique attention-related difficulties that can significantly impact their daily lives. These challenges may manifest in various ways, such as struggling to maintain focus for extended periods, experiencing difficulties with selective attention and filtering out distractions, or finding it challenging to shift attention between different tasks or stimuli. Additionally, neurodivergent people may encounter difficulties with sustained attention, making it challenging to stay engaged in activities that require prolonged mental effort. 
By recognizing and understanding these common attention-related difficulties, we can develop targeted strategies to support neurodivergent women in optimizing their attentional abilities. Neurodivergent conditions such as ADHD, hyper, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, autism spectrum disorders, dyslexia, and others can have a profound impact on attention. For example, people with ADHD often experience difficulties with sustained atten sustaining attention, managing distractions, and maintaining organization and task initiation. Similarly, individuals on the autism spectrum may have attentional challenges related to sensory sensitivities or difficulties with shifting attention between social cues and environmental stimuli. Understanding how these neurodivergent conditions interact with attention can help us tailor interventions and support strategies to address the specific needs of neurodivergent women. It is important to recognize that attention challenges in neurodivergent people can be further complicated by the presence of overlap overlapping sy symptoms and conditions. For instance, both ADHD and autism can coexist in a person, leading to a complex interplay of attention-related difficulties. Conditions such as anxiety or depression can impact attention, further exacerbating challenges. By acknowledging the potential overlap of symptoms and conditions affecting attention, we can work on a comprehensive and holistic approach to support neurodivergent people effectively. By understanding attention and the unique needs and experiences of neurodivergent people, we can provide targeted support that fosters your strengths and empowers you to thrive in various aspects of your life. Factors affecting attention. Attention can be influenced by various internal factors that impact your cognitive processes. Emotional state plays a role as heightened emotions such as anxiety or frustration can disrupt attentional focus. Fatigue can also significantly impair attention, making it more challenging to sustain focus and engage effectively. Stress levels can impact attention, with high levels of stress often leading to decre decreased attentional resources. By recognizing and managing these internal factors, you can optimize your attentional abilities and improve your overall cognitive functioning. External factors also play a significant role. The environment in which you work can impact your ability to concentrate. Noise levels, visual distractions, or cluttered spaces can disrupt intentional focus. Technological distractions, such as social media notifications or constant email alerts, can pull your attention away from the task at hand. Creating an environment that minimizes distractions and supports focused attention can greatly benefit you. Attention in everyday life. Attention isn't something that we only have to worry about when it comes to school. It plays a role in all aspects of our lives. Attention in the workplace. You may encounter specific challenges related to attention in your professional life. Meeting deadlines, staying organized, and managing multiple tasks simultaneously can pose difficulties. Additionally, navigating open office environments or dealing with frequent interruptions can disrupt attentional focus. Strategies such as implementing effective time management techniques, breaking tasks into manageable chunks, utilizing visual aids or reminders, and creating conducive work environment can support you in optimizing your attention and productivity in the workplace. Attention at home. Managing household tasks and responsibilities requires attentional focus and organization. You may struggle with maintaining attention on household chores, organizing schedules, or managing family commitments. Your house might be messy. Your children might regularly be late to school or sports. Staying on top of everyone's schedules can feel overwhelming. Establishing routines, utilizing visual or written reminders, and involving family members in task delegation can help improve attention and task management skills at home. Attention in social settings. Neurodivergent people may find it challenging to sustain attention and engage in social interactions. Noisy environments, social anxiety, or difficulty in interpreting social cues can impact attention in social settings. No one wants to be a bad friend, so learning to navigate social situations successfully is important. It takes practice, so be patient with yourself. Develop active listening skills and use strategies such as repeating or summarizing information to reinforce understanding can aid in improving interpersonal skills and communication. Practicing self-care techniques can help manage anxiety and can help you maintain focus and meaningful engagement during social interactions. The strategies mentioned above serve as starting points for cultivating attentional skills, but it is important to remember that individual needs and preferences may vary. Nurturing attention. If you want to improve your attention skills, you need to give yourself space to explore different strategies and try things in all areas of your life. Self-advocacy for attention needs. 
You need to develop self-awareness regarding attention strengths and challenges. By recognizing your unique attentional patterns, you can advocate for your needs in various settings. This includes communicating with employers about specific attention-related accommodations that may be beneficial. Cultivating self-advocacy skills empowers you to take an active role in managing your attention and accessing support. Seeking support and accommodations. Neurodivergent people can benefit from seeking support and accommodations to optimize their attention. This may involve collaborating with others to establish strategies for attention management, discussing accommodations with employers such as flexible scheduling or providing a quiet workspace can create an environment that supports attentional needs. Seek out resources and support groups specifically tailored to neurodivergent people can gain valuable insights and strategies for attention enhancement. Leveraging strengths for attention enhancement. Neurodivergent people possess unique strengths and abilities that can be harnessed to enhance attention. By embracing your neurodiversity and recognizing your strengths such as creativity, attention to detail, or the ability to hyperfocus, you can leverage these qualities to optimize your attentional skills. Engaging in activities that align with your interests and strengths can foster a sense of engagement and enhance intentional focus. Understanding attention is essential for neurodivergent people as it serves as a foundational cognitive skill that impacts various aspects of their lives. Recognizing the impact of attention in everyday life, we've discussed attentional management strategies in the workplace, at home, and social settings. Additionally, we've emphasized the importance of nurturing attention in neurodivergent people through self-awareness, self-advocacy, seeking support and accommodations, and embracing neurodiversity. Remember that attention is not a static trait, but a skill that can be developed and nurtured. By fostering attention awareness and seeking necessary support, you can learn to embrace your individuality, harness your strengths, and and thrive in a world that values and accommodates diverse attentional needs. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the F-Bomb podcast. Thank you for listening. Remember to subscribe below and check out my show notes to learn more about my Facebook group, courses, and membership. Thank you.